On the day after Christmas, in December of 1996, the Kempton Park Hospital closed its doors. Once a state-of-the-art hospital that thrived on caring for the sick was now turned into an abandoned building. No warning was given for the hospital closing down, except for the fact that it stopped accepting patients earlier that month. You would have expected there to be an official reason for the closure, but up till today, no statement has been given. When the doors of the hospital closed, millions of rands of technology and assets were left behind. Things that could have been used in other places and transferred to other hospitals were just left to rot away. Among those things were machines that at the time were state-of-the-art technology. Why were these things left behind? And why did no one return to a perfectly functional and possibly profitable hospital? The answer to that question may lie in the legends surrounding it. The Kempton Park Hospital is a hotspot for many amateur ghost hunters and explorers. These people claim that the hospital is haunted and that they have experienced many different forms of paranormal activity within its walls. However, are any of these legends true or are we destined to never know? Let's look at one of the main claims and honestly the most disturbing one. Many explorers who enter the hospital claim to hear the sound of crying babies. If this is a real paranormal event, then we can assume that those children died in the hospital, which makes a lot of sense considering the hospital's strange history. Dr. Andre Esterheisen was a pediatrician at Kempton Park Hospital in the 1980s. In his time, he worked on a multitude of children, and most of them seemed to turn out okay. A few died, but he wasn't directly blamed for their deaths until a dark secret came out. You see, Dr. Andre Esterheisen wasn't a real pediatrician, he just posed as one. The reality of the situation was that he had no official education as a doctor and had not attained a degree. He may have trained himself, but that doesn't mean that he was qualified. Knowing this fact, the deaths of the children in the hospital can be blamed on him and his negligence. If people who explore the hospital have been hearing the sound of children crying, it may be the children who died at the hands of Esterheisen. The spirits may not be able to rest because of their unlawful death. Hey guys, if you like this video, then a sub to the channel would be amazing as I'm trying to release new videos every day. Also, leave your suggestions and comments down below as I reply to every one of them. Thank you for watching. This is Dark Life Productions signing out.